Hello, I'm Tupper, head of community for VRChat. These are the video patch notes for VRChat 2023.2.4. Let's get right into it. First off, we've added the much requested avatar scaling feature. Using scaling, you can change the size of your avatar on demand in the action menu. To use it, hold down the B or menu button on either hand to open the action menu. That's the radial or circle menu that appears on top of your hand. Go to expressions, then quick actions. Avatar height will be on the left, and when you select it, you'll open up a dial that lets you change the size of your avatar. We call this user scaling mode. Additionally, you can click on anyone, scroll down a little bit, and select the new match eye height button. This will match your eye level to their eye level, which is really useful for having a conversation with someone without having to stare up or down at them the whole time. World authors can also implement scaling rules and systems with Udon. This is called World Scaling Mode. We have a ton of Udon functions available that allow you to change the range of scaling, get or set someone's height, and more. This opens up a ton of possibilities for games and experiences involving changing your avatar's scale. For avatar authors, we added some ways for you to interact with scaling too. We added a bunch of avatar parameters that allows you to detect the current scaling state, which you can then use to trigger all kinds of behavior or transformations or whatever when an avatar is being scaled. Finally, if you're a world author and you just want to turn off scaling, log into the VRChat home website, click on My Worlds on the left, click on your world, toggle off avatar scaling, click save, and you're done. Scaling is now off in your world. Next up, we've added search to our settings. When you open up settings, type the first few letters of what you're looking for and it should pop up. This is a lot easier than trying to remember where that one setting is every single time. We've also implemented our first pass at localization with this release. Our community-powered localizations of Korean, Spanish, French, and Italian are now live with this update. The tooltips in our quick and main menus will now appear in your selected language. You can select a different language in the main menu. Finally, we've gone through the quick menu to update the design and layout. It now matches the main menu and the controls should be quite familiar. On to the fixes and improvements. When you upload new content like emoji, icons, and avatars, that content will appear immediately in your menus instead of requiring a restart. Avatars now get cleared out of memory 60 seconds after you saw them last instead of 5 minutes later. This should help with devices that have low memory like the Quest 2. If you participate in a vote kick, you'll now be told what the results are after it's done. When you disconnect from VRChat, we've improved the messaging that you get as well as the reconnection behavior. That's it for this video patch notes. As usual, check the description for the full patch notes. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.